Today's YouTube video will be on how to install a Max Air vent cover on your recreational vehicle. The Max Air vent cover allows you to leave your roof vents open while protecting the RV's interior from foul weather damage and heat. It also allows a constant airflow of fresh air while traveling down the highway, preventing that undesirable heat buildup on your RV's interior. There is no roof drilling and it installs in a matter of minutes with just a few simple hand tools. It literally took me more time getting everything together than it took me to do the actual install. The hardware consists of aluminum brackets and some fine stainless steel screws, bolts, nuts, and washers. Now for the install. First, make sure you take all safety precautions during this install as it requires you to work on the roof of your RV. Don't work under any power lines and always have someone nearby if the need arises for help. Be sure your RV roof will allow for your weight as you may need a piece of plywood to put down to help distribute your weight. Next, from the roof, place the vent cover over the existing roof vent making sure you have it facing in the correct direction. Once in position, you might make a test opening to check for clearance. This is where a helper comes in handy. Once you have it where you want it, take a marker and mark the 12 slotted holes on the roof surface, three on each corner. Now remove the vent cover and set it aside. Take the four aluminum L brackets and place them at the four corners of your RV's vent where you've marked 12 slots on the roof. If you have any questions, just watch the YouTube slideshow. Where brackets contact the metal vent frame, mark the small hole on the vent frame, making sure you center the elongated slots on the bracket over one of the three marks that you made on the roof. Do this for all four corners. Now take a 3 inch drill bit and tap a hole in the RV's metal vent frame where you previously marked with a dot. Do all four corners the same way. Do not drill into your RV's roof. Now take a carriage bolt and place in the elongated slot of the L bracket with the threads facing upward. Take one of the small Phillips head screws provided and secure the bracket to the RV's metal vent frame, backing it up with a flat washer, lock washer, and nut. Tighten it securely. Make sure that the carriage bolt remains loosely in place with the threads facing up. Do all four corners the same way. Once this is complete, place the Max Air vent cover back in position making sure the four carriage bolts stick up through the base of the cover in one of the three slots that allows for best clearance of the vent when it is opened and closed. After making a test opening and being satisfied with the placement, place a flat washer, lock washer, and nut over the carriage bolt. Tighten it down, but do not over tighten as this vent cover is only made out of plastic. No sealant or caulk is required as this air gap allows for any drainage of moisture from rain and condensation. Now your vent is installed. All that's left is cleaning up your tools and testing the vent. Prices vary. Amazon carries the vent covers for around $33.75 and Camping World carries them for a few bucks more. Mine, well I found them new at a yard sale where the owner was intimidated by the install and never used them. The price, well I can't really say as theft is a misdemeanor and my purchase price was really a steal. Hope the video helped and happy 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 RVing.